Gotta love this. The article in the Daily Mail says, Watch the ISS fly through an aurora. Time lapse reveals moment a solar ejection bathed the space station in light, right? So it says, ESA astronaut Alexander Gerst has captured stunning footage from the ISS, right? Stunning footage. And so we come down here, and we look at this stunning footage, and A, it's crap. It's like, you know, 100 DPI resolution. It's pathetic. And then it says, above can be seen an animation of the moment ESA astronaut Alexander Gerst and his crewmates on the ISS spotted the aurora around the ISS. It's like, really? <laughs> what happened to the footage that you're touting? You know, the spectacular footage. They have to put up yet another animation. Just, it's just, uh, it's pathetic. And by the <laughs> what way, else can I'm, you say? I'm going to show you the film of the ghost I had in my attic, but um, instead of, it's just going to be an animation, though. It's not really the footage. <laughs> I'm going right. to make keep the footage and just give you the animation. That's right, but don't forget to sell it, you know, as actual footage, you know, high definition at that. Let's uh, yeah. throw that in there. It's stunning, stunning footage. And the animation is crap. I mean, it's they couldn't even come up with a good animation. And, you know, again, we've never seen this. And, and why would the, you know, ISS, you would think that if they're flying over the North Pole and right through the Aurora Borealis, that we should get some of the most fantastic visuals from that. Uh, ever seen.